Hi friends, this is Miss Horrocks. I am an elementary art teacher at West Valley One. And I'm going to share with you my lesson on astronauts and spaceships in outer space. Now friends, I made this using stuff that I found around my house. I found some paper at my house. Any kind of paper would do. Maybe the back of some mail, you can get creative. Um, at my house, I had a pencil and I had a Sharpie. Any marker will work. I had an eraser. I also found one of my pencil sharpeners. So friends, anything you can gather at home is a-okay with me. Um, you can color this with whatever you have laying around. I have these prisma sticks. You can use whatever works for you. If you don't have anything to color with at home, just bring it when we come back to school and you can color it using the stuff in your teacher's classroom. Alrighty, so normally when I see you, we start with a warm up, but I am not there to give you a warm up. So let's warm up together on a blank piece of paper. <clears throat> Alrighty, it doesn't matter which direction your paper's going, it's just for practice, but let's start with our elements of shape. Our elements of what? That's right, elements of shape. First we have our dot, our what? That's right, dot. Anything roundish that's colored and get ready. Next we have a circle, a what? Anything roundish that's empty. Remember, it doesn't have to be a perfect circle. It can be anything that is closed and empty. Next we have a straight line, a what? A straight line has no bend. And a curved line, a what? A curved line bends in any direction. Remember friends, a spiral line is a curved line too. And last but not least, we have an angle line, a what? It bends so much that it comes to a point. Alrighty friends, turn your paper over. So friends, on the back of your paper, let's do a warm up of some of the shapes that we're going to be seeing. So friends, in our astronaut, we're going to have curved lines, angle lines, all sorts of things like that. So let's draw a curved line. Under that, let's draw a straight line. Inside, a curved line. And a straight line. And inside that, let's draw two curved lines. Awesome job. Friends, let's draw a straight line, a curved line, a curved line, a straight line, a straight line, a curved line, a curved line. <clears throat> let's draw a curved line, a curved line, a curved line, a curved line, a circle, and a circle. Alright friends, I think our brains and our hands and our eyes are ready to start. So let's get a blank piece of paper and begin. I am going to start with my paper on a tilt. I've already decided that I want my astronaut to go right about here. <clears throat> so friends, I'm starting with a curved line. What? That's right, curved line. It bends in any direction. Next, I have a straight line. A what? A straight line has no bend. I'm going to zoom in closer so that you guys can see these details now that you know where I'm at on my page. Next, I have a curved line and a straight line, a curved line, and a curved line. I'm going to color this in now since I'm using marker. If you're using pencil, you can color it in later. Friends, if I'm going too fast, you can press pause. And if you want to go back and try something again, you can press rewind. Alrighty guys, now I'm going to draw two straight lines that come out like that. And connect them with a straight line. 
And you're going to draw two lines that come straight down just like this. <clears throat> To draw two straight lines that come in and an angle line. It bends so much that it comes to a point. Next I'm going to draw his feet. I am going to draw two straight lines. One's a little longer than the other <clears throat> and a curved line. Same thing on this side. Two straight lines and a curved line. I'm going to draw two straight lines right about there. All right guys, next for his arms, I'm going to draw a curved line and a curved line, a curved line and a curved line. I'm going to draw four straight lines or kind of a rectangle shape on each side. Next I'm going to draw something that's going to kind of look like a mitten. So friends I've got a curved line and a curved line, a curved line and a curved line. Next, I'm going to draw some details right about here. I'm going to draw a square with another square inside of it. I'm going to draw two curved lines right about here. And then last, I'm going to draw his air tank. It's kind of like a backpack. So I've got two angle lines just like that. And an angle line just like that. So it kind of looks like he is wearing a backpack. My friends, if you want to draw more astronauts, you can rewind and then draw as many astronauts as you want. So. There is my first astronaut. I think I'm going to draw just one for this video. You can do whatever you would like. Next, I'm going to put in my rocket ship. And if you are in my first grade class, then we already drew this last week. So you are already pros. But friends, for that, I am going to imagine where I want it to go. I want it to go right about here. <clears throat> and I'm going to draw a planning dot. That planning dot is going to be the nose of my spaceship. You guys, I've got a curved line and a curved line. And I'm connecting those two things with a curved line. Up top, I'm going to draw a curved line and a circle. Anything roundish that's empty, right? Inside of my circle, I'm going to draw another circle. And I'm going to draw two curved lines just right here. Remember friends, if I'm going too fast, you can press pause. I'm going to draw a straight line and a straight line and a straight line. Here I have a straight line a straight line and a straight line. Okay, friends, next we have the fire that's coming out of the back of our rocket ship. Now friends, this is a bunch of curved lines, so I'm gonna get real close. Alrighty guys, we're gonna draw a bunch of curved lines. Let's go. There's one and another one. I'm going to draw a straight line in, straight line in. And a curved line, and a curved line. Ready? let's do another layer. Curved line, curved line. Those are bigger than the ones that I drew before. They're on the outside. Straight line, straight line. Curved line, curved line. 
straight line, straight line, and curved line, curved line. Here we have one astronaut and one rocket ship. If you want to draw any more astronauts or rocket ships, then you can just look at the video again, or you can draw from memory. That's also good too. Alrighty guys, I'm gonna put some things in the background. Right here, I'm going to draw Earth. I'm going to start with a circle, a what? Anything around us that's empty. And friends, I'm going to fill it in with some shapes. These are organic shapes. Organic shapes don't have names. They're just kind of blobs. Just some wavy lines to fill up the space. Friends, next I'm going to draw Saturn. Saturn has rings. So friends, to do that, I'm going to draw a curved line like this. It looks kind of like a C. I'm going to draw another curved line that goes around it. If you want to watch that again, remember, you can rewind. Okay, friends, then I'm going to draw a curved line that kind of looks like a circle being covered up. We have Saturn and his rings. Okay, friends, next I'm going to draw some stars. Friends, you can draw these lots of different ways. I'm just going to draw circles to keep it simple. You can draw your stars any way you want. Now, friends, I'm going to look at my page. I'm going to see if I have any spots that look kind of empty. I want to make sure that all of the spots of my page have something cool going on there. Now friends, you can color this with whatever you've got hanging out at your house. At my house, I have these Prisma sticks. You could use markers, you could use crayons, you could use color pencils, you could do anything that you would like. My friends, I hope that you love your astronauts and your spaceships, and I have loved drawing these with you. I'll see you very soon. Bye, friends.